A Bunsen burner is a laboratory apparatus, it is used as a source of heat. The burner is named after Robert Bunsen, a German scientist who designed it in 1857. Let us identify the parts of a Bunsen burner. The type of flame produced when the air holes are closed is called a luminous flame. It is produced when there is no enough air to mix with the gas. This causes incomplete combustion. This flame is not preferred for laboratory work. It can contaminate samples with soot. The type of flame produced when the air holes are open is called a non-luminous flame. This flame is suitable for heating in the laboratory. The chimney or barrel is where gas and air mix to produce a flame. The collar opens and closes to control the amount of air entering the chimney. It turns clockwise and anticlockwise. Air holes allow air into the burner. Air contains oxygen which supports burning. The gas valve or tap controls the amount of gas entering the Bunsen burner. The base is wide and heavy. It provides support for the burner making it stable on the working surface. The rubber tubing connects the gas inlet to the gas source. The gas inlet is the part where the gas supply is connected to the burner. Other sources of heat that can be used in the laboratory include the following. A candle, a spirit lamp, a kerosene stove, and a gas stove. However, the Bunsen burner is the most suitable and the recommended source of heat for use in the laboratory.